am going to explain about Java interview questions and answers. What is Java? Java is a high-level, platform-independent programming language. Java is made up of various objects. Sun Microsystems created it. Many programs, websites, and video games are created using the Java programming language. What are the characteristics of Java? Java has the following features. OOP concepts. Object-oriented. Inheritance. Encapsulation. Polymorphism. Abstraction. Platform independent, a single program runs unchanged across various platforms. How does Java facilitate high performance? The just-in-time compiler is used by Java to enable great performance. The instructions are changed into bytecodes using it. What are the IDEs of Java? The IDEs of Java are Eclipse and NetBeans. What is Constructor? The constructor may be thoroughly explained using the following point. Whenever a new object is generated in a program, the appropriate function object for the class is called. A method with the same. Name as the class is the function object. A default function object will be built if the user doesn't explicitly build one. There is a possibility of the constructor getting overloaded. If a function constructor with a parameter was established by the user, he or she should expressly create another function object without a parameter. Define local and instance variables. Local variable, the definition of local variables and their range is contained within the method itself. Instance variables are defined both inside and outside of the method, and their scope is shared by the entire class. Describe a class. A class defines all Java codes. It has options and processes. Variables are properties that specify how a class is in a given state. The precise business logic must be performed in methods. It includes a series of declarations or instructions that fulfill the specific criterion. For instance, public class edition forward slash forward slash class name declaration. Int a equals 5 forward slash forward slash variable declaration. Int b equals 5. Public void add forward slash forward slash method declaration. Int c equals a plus b. Define object. An instance of a class may be referred to as an object. Its state and behavior are both available. Every time the JVM encounters the new keyword, an instance of that class will be created. Can you list out the concepts in OOPs? The OOP's concepts include Inheritance Encapsulation Polymorphism Abstraction Interface What is the task of encapsulation? Encapsulation performs the task of Protecting code from others Code maintainability Describe polymorphism Polymorphism means multiple forms it is a single object's caliber to refer to any of the classes whether a superclass or subclass as per the reference type. We can use the manipulation reference type to invoke the add function of the addition class. Polymorphism is the name given to this talent. In contrast to overloading, polymorphism is appropriate for overriding. We can use the manipulation reference type to invoke the add function of the addition class. Polymorphism is the name given to this talent. In contrast to overloading, polymorphism is appropriate for overriding. What does method overriding entail? The following conditions must be met by the subclass method and the superclass method in order for method overriding to occur. The same method name should be used. The argument must be the same. The return type must be the same. The main advantage of overriding is that the subclass can supply more particular information than the superclass about that subclass type. Explain overloading in Java? The correct answer is that method overloading can occur between classes or even inside the same class. For method overloading, the subclass method together with the superclass method, or methods from the same class itself should meet the following requirements. Same approach. 
various forms of arguments. There could be various return kinds. What does interface mean? In Java, multiple inheritances are not possible. The interface concept is presented as a solution to this issue. An interface is a template that contains method declarations, not the actual implementation of the methods. The following are some features. Internally, each interface method is a public abstract void. All of the interface's variables are internal public static final constants. Classes may not extend, they may only implement the interface. All of the methods declared in the interface should have an implementation in the class that implements it. What does abstract class mean? The abstract keyword placed before the class name allows us to build the abstract class. Both abstract and non-abstract methods that are of a concrete class can be found in an abstract class. Abstract approach. The abstract method is one that just has a declaration and no implementation, and it has the keyword abstract in its name. A semicolon indicates a declaration's end. A non-abstract method may also be present in an abstract class. The implementation of abstract methods should be provided by the concrete subclass that extends the abstract class. Define string, string builder, and string buffer. String, a constant string pool is where string variables are kept. The old value from the constant string pool cannot be removed once the string reference has changed it. String buffer, in this case, string values are kept in a stack. If the values are altered, the new value will take the place of the previous value. Because it is synchronized, the string buffer is thread safe. The performance is comparatively slower than that of a string builder. String builder, with the exception of the string builder, which cannot be threaded safely and is not synchronized, this is identical to the string buffer. It follows that the performance is quick. Differentiate between hash map and hash table, we can differentiate between the two in the following points. Hashmap's methods are not synchronized while Hashtable's key methods are synchronized. While Hashtable offers thread safety, Hashmap is not. For iterating the values iterator is used in Hashmaps, but in Hashtable enumerator is used. Hashmap allows one null key as well as several null values. On the contrary, Hashtable does not allow anything null. Hashmap has a higher performance than Hashtable. Thanks for watching.